Okie dokie artichokey. If anyone ever wonders whether I get nervous before I do a cake, the answer is hell yes. This cake I made the other day and I was really nervous in the lead up to it, even though I had made this design once before. You might be able to see the shape coming together. It is, of course, a shoe. And it was over a year ago when I made this cake the first time. But I just remember it being really, really difficult. And yeah, one of the hardest cakes I'd ever done. So I, I yeah, I was a bit nervous. So before any decorating can begin, we've got to do a little bit of planning. Me and Katie, who is my business partner, and she also bakes all the cakes that I do. We have to decide what size cake needs to be baked, the cake board needed, uh, how much fondant is required, and also the ganache that needs to be made in advance. I also like to do a little bit of research on the cake that I'm doing, um, get dimensions and all that jazz. And then I like to try and work out approximately how long the cake is going to take me. I always overestimate because I like to give myself more time than needed just so I'm not super stressed. There's nothing worse than decorating a cake with that pickup time looming over you. It can just really affect your work. So you want to you wanna be nice and relaxed while you're decorating. I started this cake late morning the day before collection. And then I worked throughout the whole day and I knocked off in the late arvo, but I still hadn't finished. I then came in the next morning and I worked on it for about three or four more hours and it was collected at about lunchtime that day. So I would say that I put one full work day of decorating into this cake, but that doesn't include the baking and the planning. So in case you can't tell, the cake is a Nike, Nike Air Max. Who else here in Australia pronounces it Nike? Because I do and I've, I've been told that is wrong. But I don't know, I think it just sounds better that way. Or is that just me? Anyway, I absolutely loved making this cake. I loved the colour scheme, being all pink, which is my favourite colour. And even though I was super happy with the first one that I did almost a year ago now, I reckon that this one is a step up. I think it's an improvement. But once again, that could just be because I love pink. <laughs> so I'm now adding the laces to the cake, which it was the last thing to go on, and it really completes the whole look. But... That's not where my work ends. After the cake is finished, I then have to go home and edit this video. I reckon it probably took me about six hours to put this video together. So yeah, thank you for sticking around and watching and I hope you enjoyed it. Bye!